So like most photographers, uh, I actually suffer quite badly with gas. Um, and I don't mean flatulence or wind, although my wife would probably disagree with that statement. Um, what I mean is the abbreviation gear acquisition syndrome, which is essentially just where we're constantly searching for new pieces of gear, new pieces of equipment, I guess in the vain hope to make us better photographers. And I'm not saying that's a false statement, you know, if buying new equipment, new cameras is going to either A, inspire you to go out and take more pictures or B, just up you to that next level in your photography, then I see no issues with that. It's a good thing. It's just a very expensive hobby to have. They say, get your kids into photography young because they'll never get a drug habit or anything like that when they're older because they simply won't be able to afford it. Um, but yeah, I try my hardest not to suffer with this ailment. Um, I try to be happy with like the gear that I've got. Often for extended periods of times, so I might just shoot with one camera and one lens. I guess kind of in the hope to, to master that before I then move on to the next thing. But in the age we live in, you know, of social media and YouTube channels and blog posts and all this stuff, it's definitely hard not to suffer with it when you're constantly seeing what other people are using, what they're shooting with, new equipment's constantly coming up. Um, it's tricky, definitely tricky. So for those of you that follow my channel or follow me on social media, you'll probably be aware that I've recently got a lot more into film photography and I'm loving it. I just love the aesthetics of film. I love how different it is to digital and the looks that you can get out of it. And uh, I recently picked up a Mamiya C330 uh, TLR, which is a medium format film camera that shoots square six by six negatives. And although I'm loving it so much, um, I feel like I'm missing out by shooting only square. So I've been looking at a six by seven cameras just to get that little bit of extra wiggle to the negatives so I can shoot uh, landscape and portrait and mix it up a little bit. And um, like I always do with everything, I've done extensive research. Like you can ask my wife, I'm sitting there constantly reading blog posts, reading, uh, looking on Google, watching YouTube videos, comparing photos and stuff. And I pretty much dwindled it down to just two cameras that I'm interested in maybe purchasing. Um, and that's the Mamiya RZ67 and the Pentax 67, which are very popular amongst a lot of uh, film photographers, especially ones that shoot portraits and stuff, uh, for good reason, because they're, they're awesome cameras. Now what I've done is I've uh, rented the camera, so um, I'm not sure if you've heard of an app called Fat Llama. Um, lovely name, by the way. <laughs> uh, yeah, so basically it's just an app where you can rent all kinds of stuff, Playstations, TVs, you know, loads of gear. But uh, one of the best things on there is photography equipment. So there's not many places in the UK where you can rent photography equipment, especially film cameras. So it's really good for that. Uh, and I found a guy who lives like a 40 minute drive from me. He's got the uh, Mia RZ67 with the 110 2.8 lens which is what I would be interested in buying. So I've rented it off him for the week. I'm gonna go pick it up now, and then uh, hopefully I'll use it this week for maybe shooting like a portrait session and some landscapes and stuff, just to really kind of put it through its paces and stuff and see if I like it. Um, so yes, yeah, so I'm gonna go pick that up now. picked up the camera um, he showed me like a few things because obviously I've never used it before so he gave me a little walk through of it ah. now, I read that it was heavy but I didn't re realize quite how heavy it is um, but yeah here it is Mamiya RZ67 so I um, I've got it for the week so I'm gonna try and book in maybe a portrait session and then maybe try and shoot some landscapes or something with it as well um, but because I'm very impatient, I might just take out like my kids today. I think actually that my wife's taking my son out for like a play date with his friends, so I might just take my daughter out and test a test a role, put a role of portrait for it or something, shoot some portraits with her, and uh, see what we're getting. Mm -hmm. 